<laughs> hey, it's me, Jimmy D, and welcome to our Scooby-Doo and Guess Who Season 2 episode reviews. Before we get into it, I review all the episodes, and I review a lot of other shows, so make sure you hit that subscribe button. I'm here with Allie, and what did you think of the Housie episode? I mean, <laughs> it wasn't terrible, but it wasn't It wasn't amazing. amazing. Um... So I think with these Scooby-Doo episodes, it takes a perfect mixture of mystery and celebrity to make a amazing episode like they did with The Flash and Mark Hamill. They, yep. they had a perfect amount of Scooby-Doo story, mystery, but also had a lot of focus on the actual person they were with. That's why I think those two episodes do so well. You have Mark Hamill um, dealing with swords and being just Mark Hamill throughout the whole episode. With The Flash, you have him being Flash, but he's interacting with the gang on their terms, on their mysteries. The Halsey episode here, I feel like, leaned way too heavily in the mystery side for once. Typically, they wait, lean way too much on the celebrity. But this time, I think they leaned way too much in the mystery because the mystery was good, but there was no point for Halsey to be there. Yeah, it didn't make much sense on why she was there. Um, yes, she was part of... She was in this poetry slam, but like... But that was like... That was it. it. There was no other reason for her to be there, and... It was good... But for a celebrity guest episode of Scooby-Doo, it just wasn't great. I feel like they missed the mark on this one. Yeah, because I was really excited for this one. I, I wanted to see how they were going to have her in here. Um, because the Sia, there was a Sia episode last season. And that one was, it wasn't horrible, but it was decent. It had a good mystery. It had, it had so much with Sia in it, it wasn't even funny. And this one, I feel like, they just, they didn't, they didn't even need the celebrity. Because they just had this normal Scooby-Doo mystery in the sewers of, Uni of New York on their own. I would agree. So, <clears throat> it's, it's a little touchy. Um, what would you rate it? I mean, it wasn't terrible, but like, if we're gonna go with like, celebrity-wise, then I'd rate it on... Four, but as like an overall Scooby Doo like episode, I guess like a five. I I'm thinking six and a half because I feel like because I'm comparing it to the other episodes we've seen. I feel if like I'm too because I feel like the Mark <clears throat> Hamill and the Flash. Flash is just the best. Out of this whole season so far. Yeah, it honestly has been the best. But I feel also oh, feel like out of all the episodes, Halsey is still right behind those two <laughs> compared to the other two episodes. The Whoopi Goldberg and the George Whoopi Decay. Goldberg is still by far the worst. Yep. And I and honestly, I rather, I had enjoyed this episode way much, a lot more than last episode with George Decay. The mystery kept me intrigued for this episode. I was bored by both this episode and the last episode. So I'm hoping that, you know, the next episode it gets a little bit better. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Let us know what you thought of the episode in the comments below. Me and Allie stream on Twitch Tuesdays through Saturday. And we also have a very active Discord. So all that is in the description below. And like always, we will see you in the next one. Later.